With every great rotary project comes a compression test, especially if you're like me, using the same original motor that came with the car. Your palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy, there's vomit on your sweater already, mom spaghetti. It's a normal feeling. Every new rotary owner goes through this. If you're in the same situation as me, you are not alone. Let me break it down for you and what you need to do. But without further ado, let's officially get those compression numbers and let's keep moving forward. We are now onto the fun stuff. Press the button on the side to turn on the compression tester. Once the screen says begin cranking, then you are ready to go. Make sure to press the throttle to be fully opened. Then you can start cranking. 